Are thousands of dead fish washing up on the Japanese coast following the release of the wastewater from the Fukushima nuclear power plant? That's what one video shared in Chinese and Korean claims. Let's get down to the truth behind this clip. It's a video that's been shared hundreds of thousands of times on social media, especially by Chinese and South Korean users. It alleges that thousands of dead fish are floating in the waters near a beach after Tokyo started releasing wastewater from the Fukushima nuclear power plant on the 24th of August. An earthquake followed by a tsunami in 2011 damaged the Fukushima nuclear power plant, contaminating water within the facility with highly radioactive material. Since the disaster, the company running the power plant, TEPCO, has been pumping in water to cool down the reactors. This means every day the plant produces contaminated water, enough to fill more than 500 Olympic swimming pools. And that storage space is about to run out, according to the country's authorities. And leaving them no choice, they say, other than to begin getting rid of the wastewater into the Pacific Ocean. The release of the treated wastewater prompted heavy criticism and panic from Japan's neighbors. China banned all Japanese seafood imports recently. And fears over radioactive contamination have prompted panic buying and boycotts of seafood in several cities in China and South Korea. By doing a reverse image search, we found the original video on Douyin, the Chinese equivalent of TikTok. It was posted on the 7th of February 2023, more than six months before Japan even started to release the wastewater. AFP managed to geolocate where the scene was filmed exactly. It was shot on a beach near the Tsutsuishi fishing port in Otaigawa City. The city is located on the west side of Japan, so on the opposite coast of the nuclear power plant and it's over 280 kilometers away. A local official told AFP that about 250 tons of dead fish were found, but that the cause of the death remains unclear. For more fact checks and investigations, check out our website, yournews.com.